Hello and welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's doing fine uh, with everything that's been going on around the world. Um, yeah, but anyways, I want to show you guys the, in my own opinion, the two knots I think you'll ever need. And they're, they're super easy to tie. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to tie these two knots. So let's get right to it. All right, so what we got here is a piece of my anchor. And I'm gonna use this as my hook. And this is the eye of my hook. So the first knot I'm gonna show you how to tie is called a polymer knot. It's a fairly well-known knot. It's super easy to tie, super strong. Well, at least it's stronger than most relationship I know. All right, so what you want to do is you want to take the line. I'm using the you know the the paracord in this just to so that you guys can see it better. So um, yeah, so you want to take your line and you want to that's a hot, make a loop like that. And what this loop with this looper here, you want to go ahead and stick it into the eye of your hook. So, so, so what, <clears throat> what I've noticed that you want your lines to be like this when you, when you go to do your overhand knot, you don't want it to be like twisted like that, you know, like that. You want it to be just nice and, and even like that. So you, you go ahead and you do an overhand knot like that. So you want to tie it down, snug it down to the eye of your, your, your hook. And you want to take this loop right here and go around your hook like so. Like that. So with everything, with the knot, every time you want to cinch down on the knot, you want to go ahead and wet the knot just to keep it from burning uh, itself. So you want to go ahead and... and uh, put some saliva or just some some water or whatever onto this knot and you just want to pull down on this knot just like that and it should sink it should uh, um, cinch up like so and if it doesn't want to tighten up you kind of just play with the tag in or, or the main the main line and just pull and it should look somewhat like this and I guarantee you it looks a lot better uh, when you actually go and tie with a smaller line. Uh, it has two wraps around the eye of your hook and that's that's gonna uh, assure you that it's you know breakage is gonna be very slim to none. So so yeah that's how you tie the polymer knot and this is the first knot I, I learned how to tie and it's it's been a very very good knot so I you know I believe everybody should, should know to tie this knot it's very easy and very strong so yeah so this is the first knot and the second knot is gonna be uh, it's called the uni knot and uh, with that knot you can you can tie just like like how I tie this hook I'm gonna show you right now or you can use it to tie two lines together, um, like a a, main, a mono to a braid, or braid to a mono, or a mono to mono. And uh, all right, so with the union knot, this is what you want to do. You want to go in and take your line and go through the eye of the hook, like so. And then what you want to do next. You have this loop like, like this so you what you want to do is you want to take you want to take you want to make a loop and you want to keep the main line with this this line and what you want to do is you want to take the tag in and you want to go over and under both both line here like so so again you want to make a loop like this and then you, you want to take the tag and you want to go over 
and under both lines, like so. And then you want to do another uh, loop over under, and you want to do it three or four times, like so. I'm just going to do it three times just to show you guys. So now you, you have the tagging which went over and under and into this loop right here that you made. Now you want to do is so you just want to pull on it like so. It's going to cinch up and now you're just going to pull the main line and it's just going to cinch all the way down onto the eye of your hook just like that. And this one has one wrap and this is very easy to tie also and I've also um, haven't lost any fish with this knot right here so that's how you tie it to a hook and now I'm gonna show you guys how to tie it two lines together and uh, it's fairly easy once you get the hang of it All right, so now I'm gonna show you guys how to tie two lines together with the uni knot. So these are my two lines that I want to tie together. Uh, this could be your braided line, your main line, and this is your mono line, in which you want want to uh, tie onto your your main line. I mean, uh, for example, you want to do drop shot. You know, I tend to use a 20 pound braided line with you know eight pound. Uh, or 10 pound mono so what you want to do is you want to take the two lines and you want to take it you want to give enough line so that you can tie two uni knots so you want to take your two lines and this is what you want to do you want to hold that line and then you want to go ahead and make a loop like so and then you just want to go over and under into the loop just like so you want to do it four or five six times and that's going to create a uni knot and that's going to cinch up like that and then now you want to turn it around like that and then you want to do the same with the other line make a loop go over under over under do it five six times Pull it, then cinch up. And now you have two uni knots. And now what you want to do is that you just want to pull it together, and those knots gonna tighten up very tight, and it's, they're gonna cinch up against each other. It's gonna it's gonna tighten up very tight, and it's gonna look somewhat like this. Uh, this is only with two wraps, so it looks crappy. But if you do five, six, ten, whatever wraps you want to do, cinch it up. And you have two uni knots, and that's how you tie two lines together. And this knot, I have yet to break. So, thank you, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys learned something today. And uh, keep on fishing.